Hi, this is Kate from Isalicious Designs. Today I'm really lucky to be able to share with you something that I've been given a sample of to, to share and show you. This is Lupit beads. They're so clever. They come in uh, packs of 500. They're pre-cut beads and they come in a variety of different colours. They're made by, well, Lupit beads. You can find them at www dot lupitbeads.com I will put the link in the description I've been lucky enough to be sent the black and white mosaic uh, well I'm not sure if it's mosaic but black and white uh, beads in a packet the blend and I've also got pink because Izzy is uh, well it's cotton candy pink um, Izzy's favourite colour is pink and they also come in pastel, a pastel blend. I've got that. But the, the amount of colours, there's black and white mix, blueberry, which is a navy blue, cantaloupe, which is a peach, cotton candy, which is pink, emerald, which is dark green, fireflies, which is glow in the dark. I think that sounds fantastic. Honey, which is gold, lavender, light purple, lime, which is a bright green, pastel mix, psychedelic mix, ruby, which is red, sky, which is light blue, sunflower, which is yellow, tangerine which is orange a tropical mix and you can also buy a four pack okay now these are four dollars 99 and you can buy it at their web store okay um they, they have a shop on their on their web page which you can buy it at so four dollars 99 and you get 500 plus of these pre-cut beads you can also get them from michael's which is nice so what what do you do with these why, why do you have pre-cut beads well this is so nice. When you open them, okay, you open the packet like this, they have a little um, snap it. They're, they're sort of like a little Ziploc bag. So when you finish taking them out, you can Ziploc them up and it's you're not relying on sticky, you know, fold it, whatever. This is just really nice and secure. I like it. The bags are strong. My cats aren't going to get into them. And you should be aware when you have animals these sorts of things are not good for them to be like if they're lying around they could eat them so you need to be really careful uh, about that so my favorite color is black i know it's not really a color is it so i'm going to do black and white and i'm going to show you how you can do this so i've got my headphones here they're very boring i very rarely use them i usually have them sort of stuffed in my bag doing nothing but i'm going to be I'm going to be the talk of the town with these. All you do is work out where you want, what colour you want, uh, and uh, what pattern, if you want a pattern, and you snap them on. I mean, how easy is that? Now, obviously, the smaller the cord, the easier they are to snap on. And you can make any kind of pattern you like, really. Um, you know what a fumble fingers I am. Oh, you've come to help me, have you? You can go away, thank you. No, no, you're not beasting these. Oh, okay, maybe you are beasting these. So look, look how easy these are to snap on. Hi, are you helping? Thank you. I love it. So I'm going to continue doing black and white down for the... It's so easy, and you can change it any time you want. And I was thinking you, you can also do shoelaces. You can do uh, larger cords, like for headphones. Izzy's always chewing. I don't know why she would want to chew on a headphone, but she chews her headphone cord, sits there watching YouTube videos and whatnot, and chomps on her cord. I'm always saying, Izzy, get that out your mouth, get that out your mouth. You know, you know, break your cord and whatnot. I'm going to put these on, and she's not going to be able to chew it. Fabulous, fabulous. And when you have, now I was working this out, when you have slightly larger cord, I'm going to get there in a minute. Oh, this is so pretty. Oh, come on. So here we go. I'm going to put one last one on here. And let's see how that looks. Oh, snazzy. I love it. That is really nice. I like that. So I'm going to continue doing mine. When you have a slightly thicker cord, now the little bit that goes to the ears, as you can see, is slightly thinner than the actual cord that comes down the, the, the base here. Let's see how it works on this, shall we? See, here's the little slit in the bead. 
It's like a pearl bead really, but with a split. Now, it's a little more difficult, as you can see, it's a little more difficult to get that in. So, what I thought, take a straw. I'm gonna chop the end of the straw off. Oh, <laughs> my cat thinks that's great fun. Here you go, you can have that. Take a straw, okay? Now I'm going to press it down really hard. Excuse me a minute, Phoebes. I'm going to get a crochet hook and I'm just going to scour the edge like this so that it's really... Oh, you're going to help? Thank you. Really, really scoured on the two sides like that. Okay, now what I'm going to do is cut down one side of it just down here. So I'm going to pop my scissors in and I'm going to cut down one side. This is not for you, love bug. So cut your scissors, cut your scissors, cut your straw down one side. Okay, you want to make sure this is nice and flat. So let's see if this helps us, because I couldn't, I couldn't do that before. I'm going to put my cord in the centre of my straw here, if I can. Fumble fingers, strikes again. Oh, it helps if I got it the right way, doesn't it? <laughs> there we go. So let's put this in. Are you helping, Phoebe? Thank you. So put my cord in. There we go. There we go. Like that. Okay. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to thread. Oops, there we go. Thread the colours that you want on this little piece here. So I'm going to start with black at the top. Because you've pinched this shut, it should be easier to thread the bead on. There we go. Oh, came off. Could you stop helping? You're really in my way. So there's one. I've got a. Stop chewing it. <laughs> You're not helping me. Okay. <laughs> oh. Why is this not working now? So slide them on like this and do the colour that you want, the pattern. So I'm just sliding them on like this. Hey you, that's enough. And you don't have to have too many. You can even just do one at a time to help you to slide it on. So slide it on to the thing and then sl it slides on much easier. See? So you slide it on to your straw, pull your cord up and it slides on. Oh, sorry Phoebe. Slide it onto your straw, hold the cord up and it slides on. And I found this a an easier way of threading them just a little bit quicker for when the cord was a little bit thick. Oops, that one came off. Let's just put that back on. There we are.
Isn't this a nifty idea? I thought it was brilliant. I've got a few more ideas of where we could use this too. And I'm going to show you in a minute. So there we go. This is uh, Lupit Beads. I love them. I think they're going to be uh, fabulous. Now I can make sure that Izzy doesn't steal my headphones. I can colour mine how I like. And hers can be a different colour to mine. And we will not mess them up. She went and said, Mummy, you've stolen my headphones. I was like, no. So what do you think? I'm going to have another play with these. I love them. Thank you so much. You could do shoelaces. Did I say shoelaces? You can do shoelaces. They've got a gallery on their website where you can see all the different ideas that they've come up with of where to do these. Oops, I'm not being, I'm being a fumble finger on this one because I'm too busy talking to you. There we go. Somebody's playing with one of the... You know those bowl, the balls of lip salve? One of the cats has got themselves a ball of lip salve and is busy thinking it's their own personal little ball to play with. Oh, this one's a small little one. There we go. Oh, it just grossed on. So look, isn't that cute? And as I said, all you do is use a straw. You don't have to use the whole straw. You can cut it, cut it down so that it's uh, a little bit smaller just fit it on and then they just slide on that little edge so easily i hope you have fun if you uh, if you like this video give me a big thumbs up and subscribe and you can find out when i do more videos take care bye